What's going on guys, Ozzy here, welcome back to a brand new video. So today we are doing a player review on the player of the month for League Un player and I have no idea how to say his name. So I've looked at his first name and I see Jeff and I know how to say that one. So he, this guy's name is now Jeff. Now Jeff is, has got 86 pace, 88 dribbling, 78 shooting, 80 passing, 75 physical. Not a greatest, the player of the month I must say. He is only worth 35k though so you have to take that into account. But that shooting slacks a little bit. Now, he is six foot, so he's outside the meta height. High, medium work rates. The perfect height, the perfect work rates for Cam. Three star, weak foot. Mm, I don't really like that. I like four stars, obviously. Uh, like, you can pass with your left foot, you can pass with your right foot. Sometimes when players have three star, weak foot, they can't really pass with their weaker foot, which is kind of annoying. Now, their four star skills are always nice to have on the Cam. This guy is on a dead eye chemistry style. He is obviously on 10 Cam. But... 88 acceleration 84 sprint speed so it's actually pretty fast for a cam that kind of surprised me but look at these shooting stats he's got 98 attacking positioning 91 91 finishing 99 shot power he's got the 76 long shots now this guy can finish inside the box clearly now he has not got finesse shot trait or outside foot trait so that's a bit worrying so he has got 94 short passing with 94 vision 81 crossing and 67 free kick accuracy with 76 curve now not the greatest curve i must admit but i'm expecting this guy to be like a a kind of guy that's always going to be there for the one twos or the, there for support really much i'm looking at that long passing and the through balls might be a bit of a sticky one now he has got 92 agility with 86 ball control 91 dribbling 80 composure 72 balance is very very worrying i must admit but other than that, he should be turning quite quick, which means I can kind of move it around in a cam position. Now, his defensive stats are actually quite impressive for a cam. Standing tackle 75, interception 73. So it looks like he kind of tracks back a lot in real life and obviously gets the tackles in. Now, he has got 88 stamina, which is always nice to have. And 81 jumping, with him being 6 foot, he will be winning headers. 73 strength though, mm, a bit low, but that 60 aggression might kill him a little bit. I kind of want a cam that fights for the ball, make sure he gets it. If he loses it, he wants to get it back. And that 60 aggression, I don't think can do that job. But I am using him around Cavani, Neymar and Mbappe just to link him. Also got Sissoko, Messi and stuff in the team. I will be using him in a 4-2-3-1, him obviously at cam. But let's get straight into the games. Nice, good spacing. Really nice pass. Oh, I must admit, gameplay right now feels terrible. Or oh, you see how he kind of gave me a passing option there. Beautiful pass. Can I finish it? No, I can't, unfortunately, with Mbappe. Oh, that's nice. Good acceleration. Fake shot into the gap. The guy has screwed up. Oh, come on. You need to finish that. Three star weak foot coming into play. He's on the edge, though. A little flip. All right. They tried to flick it. All right, I'm not going to lie. He doesn't feel agile at all. He feels very, very clunky. Switch to play. Nice, well played. Nice. What a pass. What a pass. Nice goal. Let's go. Oh, just kind of lost the ball there. Didn't know where it was. Play that. Beautiful ball. That's a nice one as well. Give it to Neymar. Oh, I just couldn't get it. Nice, he showed real aggression there, didn't he? Jesus Christ. Kind of lost it, though. That's a bit beautiful ball, yes. Nice. That's what I kind of want with his weak foot. Awesome play. Has to be perfect, and it is. Beautiful cam, I must admit. Let's go. Come on, play that pass. Make sure it's perfect. Ah, uh, you see right there. I did those passes with De Bruyne, the 94 rated, informed that I did do a play with you on. And then passes were working left, right and centre. But that's the difference between like an amazing cam and this guy right here. It's simply he can't pass that far. He's making a beautiful run there though. Use that pace. Kind of work it. There you go. There you go, man. Come on, Neymar. What a pass. You see that threaded needle pass straight through the midfield to get the goal off. Come on. Swing that all the way to Messi. It's a decent ball, to be fair. Okay, I kind of expected that to get there, but obviously the guy's going to do some madness just to get it. Pass through the gap. 
Literally perfect pass. You can't ask for any better than that. And it's a goal line clearance. Okay, okay, okay. Beautiful. On the first time finish. I must admit though, Jeff doesn't really feel that agile. He kind of feels a bit slow, which kills me a little bit. Now, running wise, he feels fast, but turning wise, that's when it comes into a bit peak. First time, switch it over. Beautiful pass. I like that how he's got that little short pass to him though. Why not? I have a dig. Why not? Oh, not the greatest shot, I must admit, but it was decent. Oh, he's right there. Okay, that's completely my fault. I shouldn't be taking that first time. I really wanted to test how his first time shot from outside the box to see if something's broken about this card. But that left foot, oh my god. Switch to play. See, that's the thing he can do. Them X passes across the across the pitch works really, really well with him. Come on, swing it. As he's with his weaker foot, you see what I mean. Now, if that's with his stronger foot, I do feel like that gets there. But because it's his weaker foot, he's using animation that kind of skids the ball across the uh, across the grass. Ah, he just doesn't feel agile at all, man. It's so annoying to move with him. Beautiful thread the needle. Oh, it could have been an amazing turn, but he was so slow on that drag back. Beautiful. That's a sensational run. Oh, my God. Weak foot coming into play, boys. Oh, that's a terrible pass. See, that's what I mean about people's weak foots. That's why you need a four-star weak foot. Simply because if it's always if it's three-star, it's not going to feel comfortable. Oh, come on. Come on, fight for it. That's nice. I like how he fought for the border. Nice, good finish. Let's go, man. I just LT'd with Lewandowski there so he could like kind of hold off the ball in a way. And it was a beautiful finish, to be fair. First time, right foot. So, it's time to review, man. Let me say straight off the back, Mr. Jeff, the player of the month from League 1. It's Cam, man. Uh, I was impressed at first, but then it started to get a bit worse. Let's just say that. 86 pace, 88 dribbling, 78 shooting, 80 passing, 75 physical. Now, six foot, way too big for a cam. This is straight off the back. Way too big for a cam, especially the way he did, like, the agility on him and the passing with that weak foot. Mm, sorry, I can't do it. High medium work rate is the perfect work rate. He was giving me a lot of passing options, which I enjoyed. But the three-star weak foot, he missed a lot with that weak foot. He started doing bad passes with that weak foot. That's why I said four-star minimum on a cam. It's simple as that. You can't you can't rely on a three-star three -star weak foot. You really can't. Four-star skills. I didn't really try out the four-star skills simply because he didn't even feel good on the ball when I was just walking with him. I couldn't imagine doing skills of him and how far the ball was going to go. Now, his pace, it was there. I do agree that it is 88 acceleration, 84 spin speed. It was nice at some points. Obviously, at other points, it wasn't great. But I feel like the 88 acceleration was really nice to have. Finishing-wise. Now, with the right foot, he was finishing a lot, I must say. Like, he, he was... Like, in front of goal, it was... It was clinical. But with the left foot... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Now... The left foot, when they were came down to finishing, he had wide opens and it just went past the post. It just, the shots were going everywhere apart from the actual goal. Which, yet again, comes down how bad the weak foot is. Short, uh, short passing, amazing. He's, his passing is crazy. Now, his long passing, no. Sorry, can't do it. Long passing was so bad, it was terrible. Like, as a cam, you expect him to have short passing and long passing. He hasn't got a long pass to save his life. But that short pass that he has, oh my god, he was threading the needle everywhere. The pass was per pinpoint perfect, agility-wise. At points, he could turn, I feel like, but at other points, it was so bad. He was like a he was like a slug trying to turn. He was just like, ugh. Now, I don't really like that. His ball control was nice to have. He didn't take one bad touch, I feel like, as far as I remember. And his balance, I didn't really see have, have a problem with his balance, which is a bit weird. But his agility, nah, it is not 92. You are lying to us, EA. Now, his standing tackle interceptions, I was kind of impressed with. Because he was doing it by himself. And the 73 interceptions and standing tackle, 75, to have on a cam, you don't see that very often. Let me just tell you that. 
Now his stamina, he didn't he didn't lose a lot of stamina at all throughout the whole game. I played 90 minutes in one of the games and his stamina bar was still there, which is always nice to have on a cam because they do run up the pitch and they do run down the pitch. Now jumping at six foot, he started win heading as a cam. So I kind of like my cam to win headers simply because sometimes it gets to their CDM because that's kind of the position your cam is in. And if they can beat a CDM to a header, you, you want to get impressed. Now, 73 strength, 60 aggression. Aggression mm, wasn't the greatest, I must admit. He didn't really fight for the badge, if you want to call it. He didn't really, you know, he wasn't up for it. But his strength, yeah, I would say he was shielding off some players. But I wouldn't say he was shielding off, you know, the screen card PKs and stuff. The ones that have the proper, proper body on them. But I have to give this card a rating out of 10. And bear in mind, obviously, he is 30, I think it's 32k currently. So it's a really, really cheap card. But I would say the only reason you're getting this card is to simply just look at the card. If you play this card, I am worried for your team. I am worried for the players around him and I am worried for him. Simple. But it's like out of 10, I, have to get, I can't give him more than a 5 out of 10. Sorry, I can't. There's no way. The card feels terrible. Yeah, he's like his pace is decent, but that's pretty much all he has. The way his six foot build is in game, is it just makes him feel clunky no matter what his dribbling is. But if you guys did enjoy this play review, leave a like, leave a comment, and for now, peace.